how much RAM does your computer need? As of April 2010, making this video, the average of computer operating system requires one gigabyte of RAM. So in order for your computer to function correctly and effectively, you need two gigabytes of RAM. This is because the average computer user surfing the internet, playing simple games, using word processing documents, software, doesn't need any more than one gigabyte of RAM because the computer doesn't have to run lots of applications at once. Um, RAM is not a simple fix on to make your computer faster. It simply means your computer can process um, opening and closing down and running applications quicker and run more applications at once. So if you're somebody that doesn't, doesn't require to have lots of applications running at once, then you're not going to need any more than 2 gigabytes of RAM. Um, unless, of course, you're running Vista, which tends to be a bit RAM hungry, so you may require a bit more RAM, maybe 3 or even 4 gigabytes of RAM. But rather than spending money on the RAM upgrade, you're probably better off upgrading to Windows 7, which you will find a lot faster on your computer than the computer running Windows Vista. So that would be my top recommendation, running Windows Vista, upgrade now, do yourself a favour. Um, any other time you're going to need lots of RAM on your computer is if you are intending to play lots of games on your computer or are going to be running lots of heavy graph software all at once and then you may require up to 4 gigabytes of RAM. If you are going to be running a 64-bit version of Windows um, 7 then you may require to um, have 4 gigabytes of RAM as well as it requires 2 gigabytes of RAM to function correctly. Um, so don't go upgrading your computer to RAM unless you have to if you find your computer to be very slow, don't touch what's, what's working because in most cases the average computer user doesn't need any more than 2 gigabytes of RAM. I hope this video has been useful to you. Um, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe to this video. And don't forget to check out my website where we're typically talking tech, um, whether you're using Windows, Mac or Linux or wish to have a wish to know more information about particular hardware um, you can over, head over to my forum on my website where uh, many of us will help are helping each other and will help you um, on choosing the best recommendations I hope you enjoyed this video and hope it's useful to you so basically don't need to upgrade your RAM unless you're struggling um, to open lots of applications at once or maybe running Windows Vista where you may wish to upgrade to Windows 7 instead of upgrading to extra RAM.